hello everyone and welcome to another video so the error we are talking about today is called the file system error on windows so it's a latest error that has come after the update where people are getting this error and it's just annoying to look at so what you need to do is first of all go to the search option over here and type down recovery you need to click on it you'll see an option that says open system restore so the best option here to fix this issue is going back to the state where your system used to work fine. So we're gonna click on next over here and you'll see a bunch of restore points over here. I have only one. You'll see many. If there's none, you'll have to skip to the step number two. So I'll just go to select step uh, the first restore point and I'll click on next. And I'll click on finish. As soon as I click finish, it will take like 5 to 10 minutes to finish the process. And after that is done, your error will be gone. The next step what you need to go do is click on search bar and write down cmd right click it run as administrator just wait for the black screen to come up as soon as the black screen comes up you'll see we have a cursor over here what you need to do is write down this command which i'm going to write down you can get it from the description the command is called check disk so it will check your system for various vulnerabilities as well as corrupted files so you can do is chkdsk followed by the drive that you are suspicious about so if you write chkdsk c drive it will check the c drive and if it, you say d drive it will check d drive so right now i'll go with c so you can see it's the file system that it uses is ntfs and it started examining it so it will take around 15 to 20 minutes i guess uh, depending upon how much files are there on your system uh, that will be step number two the next step what you need to do is again open command prompt as administrator and this time you need to write down another command this command is similar to the previous command but this one this one scans well so what you need to write down is sfc space slash scannow so this will scan your system for all the corrupted files in the latest update and fix them let's wait for it to start and as soon as it does we'll move to the final step alright so it is beginning the step let's look at how far the first step has gone alright almost done so we'll minimize both of these ones and the final step what you need to do is using the DISM command. So again go to command prompt. So just make sure you do all of these steps one by one and don't rush through them. If any of the ones work just stop there and don't go to the next step. So this would be the final step if any of the previous ones don't work this will definitely work. What you need to do is first of all wait for the black screen to come up. Write down your first command which is D I S M space slash online slash clean up image space slash check disk sorry help so it's D I S M space slash online space slash clean up image space slash check health so this will be the first command it will not take long the next thing you need to do is I'll just stop this over here Let's go to the next step So make sure you finish all these ones. Once that is done, the next command that you have to write down is similar DISM space slash online space slash clean up image space slash scan health. And once that is done, the final one will be DISM online cleanup image restore health so just wait for this to complete and the final step I'll just write down over here so you can just go through it later let's 
go to the first one all right so the final step is d i s m space slash online space slash clean up image space slash restore health so right now i'm not entering this command as my scan health is already running so we'll just wait for that one to complete and as soon as that is complete we'll just finish with this one so i hope this helped this is the three step you need to follow to fix this error uh, if you like the video please hit a like and subscribe to our channel for the latest content have a good one